crazy story. A villager asked for my help. Their village had been ransacked by pillagers, and they need a new mayor to help bring the city back to life. I'll be able to use emeralds to make upgrades to this beautiful city to make it the best anyone has ever seen. And here is my village. Oh, gosh, it looks terrible, dude. It's on fire, man. Am I the mayor or the firefighter? Let's have village, boys. I must gain favor with the elders to become mayor. Are you guys the elders? Elder librarian, elder farmer, elder mason, and elder Frank. <laughs> okay. Well, nice to meet you, Frank. So I guess I have to trade with you guys to gain favor. All right, no problem. I'll be back. I'll need bones, clay, paper, and sticks. So that shouldn't actually be too much of a problem. It's kind of an easy easy way to gain favor, man. Give me two bones and you can be mayor. <laughs> the lowest requirements of all time. We shall start with clay. I'm so excited to be mayor, man. I have a lot of ideas for this city. There's some beautiful clay. The clay balls, they're a ringing. Let's find some sugar cane. Um, sugar cane, hello? Ah, there you are. Hey, buddy. Are you a little lonely, sugar cane? Oh, no. Is it just two sugar cane? Ah, that poor lonely boy. The illustrious four block tall sugar cane. Trying to flex on us? Come on, man. I get it. You're six foot one. There's our paper. There's our sticks. Now it's bone time. Wait. Fight. Guys, no fighting. I'm going to tell mom. Can I borrow some bones? Thank you, guys. All right. We got everything. Greetings, elders. I would be honored to be your mayor. Oh, gosh. There we go. There's the sticks, clay, and bones. Thank you, Frank. And there it is. The deed to the village. I'm mayor, dudes. Congratulations. You're now the village mayor. Mayor Crafty. Good luck keeping all the citizens happy. That sounds a little ominous. Oh, no. I have a happiness counter. Increase happiness to get taxpayer funds. Interesting. Looks like I can buy an agriculture district, which would be nice, but I have no emeralds, dude. Well, I have 20, but that's not enough. I can trade the elders to get some emeralds. But for now, let's put out the fires and see if this helps. Don't worry! Mayor Crafty is on duty. Eh, eh. Yeah, come on. Yeah, I got a little bit of happiness. Oh, the more happy the villagers are, the more passive income I get. Oh, very nice. Don't worry, boys. I will make this place as good as new. As good as better than new. And I'm fire resistant for some reason. That's just the powers of being mayor. A <laughs> hundred emeralds. We can now afford our agriculture district. Let's see what we got around here. We have some farm plots, although they don't look very useful right now. Looking pretty empty. Got to do something about this as the mayor. Ah, yes. Hello, farmer. What's going on here, dude? Uh, you need something. You need, uh, either he needs a sapling or he has an idea about trees. No worries. I got you. Eh, eh, eh. Hey, there we go, got it. Mayor Crafty here. There you go, buddy. Hey, tree farm unlocked. Oh, sweet, that was easy. We got a nice little tree farm. He just took one sapling. He's like, I'm taking it from here, buddy. Okay, he needs a bit of wheat here. Um, <laughs> should I tell him? <laughs> is, is he gonna notice? Buddy, do you not know that hay bales have hay in them? All right, fine, I won't steal, at least from you. Howdy ho there, neighbors. You mind if I borrow some wheat? I promise I'll give it back. I don't speak villager, but I will assume her means yes. There you go, buddy boy. Wheat farm unlocked. Nice, looking good, dude. I don't think this can feed the entire town, but it's a good start. Next up, you need an egg, unless that guy's trying to pull a prank on you. No problem. I assume that's for the chicken coop over here. Hi, little buddy. Do you mind pooping out an egg for me, please? I will use it to make a bunch of little use. <laughs> Just watching him so close. Give me that egg. Give it to me. He's a little egg shy. I'll give you some privacy, buddy. Is it done? Yeah, there it is. And now I'm guessing we have a chicken farm, unless he just makes an omelet out of it. He's like, hmm, yes, thank you. I was hungry. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Look at the chicken coop, dude. Fully upgraded the agriculture district, so hopefully our boys can eat now. Our happiness has certainly gone up. It seems that food is the key. <gasps> more people are here. Hey, buddies. Pay taxes and become citizens. Ah, we have more people moving in. Heck yeah. Well, hope you like eating breads and chicken. It's the only thing we have around here. Now, what next can I buy? I can buy the food generator. Interesting. We'll go ahead and grab that bad boy. Please be good. I did spend all the taxpayers' monies on this, so it'd be a little embarrassing if this just kind of sucked. So it looks like I get charges by scanning animals. There we go. Thank you, Mr. Piggy. I promise this doesn't hurt him one bit. Scanning animal. Scanning. Okay, and now I just right-click it to shoot out food. <laughs> Here we go, little tree. You want some grub? There you go, buddy. Open wide. Jeremy, I got some food for you. Nom, nom. <laughs> That's awesome. 
him. Wait a second. He's giving me 50 emeralds every time I feed him. Heck yeah, man. Open wide. <laughs> good to know. That's a good way to get emeralds and also to feed my rich villagers. That's how I prefer my food shot directly in my mouth from a projectile launcher. Just a couple more emeralds and... Yes, the entertainment district is purchased. You know, after food, the second most important thing, entertainment. Oh, gosh. Let me just take care of this real quick. Everybody needs good entertainment in their life. Hey, Bunko. Oh, this place is fun. We got a little open mic. Think of me. Think of me fondly. What? So you, sir, are looking for a leather chest plate. All right, I can do that. I don't know why a leather chest plate is a part of entertainment, but sure. Nobody look. A mayor's got to do what a mayor's got to do. There's our chest plate that we borrowed from those cows. There you are, buddy boy. Warrior armor unlocked. What? Um, okay. <laughs> nice. Okay. We have like an animatronic now. Yeah, because that's never gone wrong before. Oh, no. My happiness is going down really fast. Not happy with animatronic. Understood. Let me get some stone real quick, see if that's any better. I'm kind of regretting my decision to get an entertainment district so early, but you know what? I just want my people to be happy, you know? There's our stone. There you go, buddy boy. And oh my gosh, the entertainment district fully upgraded. <laughs> Looks like I unlocked this building here. Very nice. Can I do anything with it? No? Come on, man. Please be entertaining. Boredom button. Push buttons equals fun. No, that's it? I spent a thousand emeralds of taxpayer money to press a button? The elders are gonna be so mad at me, dude. And there's nobody here. Nobody wants to become a citizen where the only entertainment is a button to press. I will make it up to you. I promise. A movie. Now that's more like it. I can't quite afford the star power, though. If you don't have enough money for it yet, I'll pay for it and you can just owe me for a bit. Sure, man. That's fine. That's fine. We'll take a little loan here, but at the very least our villagers will be happy. I've become a celebrity from star power. No, I thought it was gonna be movie. Movies. I didn't know that I was gonna make myself famous and put our whole town in debt. Uh, hey, gentlemen. Oh, gosh. No, I, I can explain. I can explain. Ah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Guys, I, oh, okay. Oh, no. I really messed up, dude. And I'm very in debt. Trust in you is at an all-time low. Win back the villagers' trust to be able to manage the town hall again. Well, I have an idea. We're not getting any more passive emeralds from the villagers' taxes, but I can charge up my food generator here, and we can feed the local villagers to get ourselves a little bit of emeralds here. There you go, boys. There you go. <laughs> Not too shabby. Just need a little bit more. Excuse me, bunnies. Can I charge this up? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, gosh. Come back here. I need to charge up my food thing. Thank you, boys. All right, that should be enough. Food for you and food for you. How hungry is this guy, man? I'm just feeding one villager. And yeah, we're finally in the net positive. I will make it up to my villagers. There we go. 700 emeralds. At least I've paid back for my star power here, which I don't think does anything. Oh, wait. No, it does have a power. If I hold it on my offhand, I can jump and then I have like an explosive landing, I guess. I mean, definitely a waste of a thousand emeralds but at least it's not completely useless. Are you guys still mad at me? Well, they're at least not attacking me, so that's good. I will earn back their trust. I will put out their fires. I will clean up the city, and maybe one day... Oh, I saw a little bit of happiness. It's working! It's working! Yes, they're paying taxes again. Okay, we're back, baby. I promise you, Elder Frank, I won't let you down again. A few moments later... <gasps> Disaster approaches! A zombie horde hungers for the village's brains! Oh, no! Well, now is my chance. Hurry, get inside. Mayor Crafty is here. Tell all your friends I'm here to save the day and stuff, please. I'd like you guys to be happy. There they are. Get up. Stand back, evil monsters. I will protect this village at all costs. There's two more lingering. Don't you eat my bacon. That's for me. Hey, yeah. Come on and yeah. Disaster averted. <gasps> the happy villagers have donated to the village. Yes, dude. All I had to do was risk my life for the happiness of my people. <gasps> Look at the bar. Yeah, feels so good, dude. The villagers trust you again. You can now access the town hall. Uh, feels good to be back, boys. Oh, snap. We can now buy the secretary, Chester. What's up, buddy? He'll make sure I stay organized and stuff. There we go. The villagers are much more confident in the combined efforts of you and secretary.
Secretary Chester. Okay, I see how it is. All income in the city is now multiplied. That's nice. Heck yeah, dude. Look at how happy everybody is, including me. I got a new friend now. Chester, what's my five o'clock? I have nothing scheduled for five o'clock. Uh, go find me a wife and then tell her I love her. Yes, dude. Look at all these villagers ready to become citizens of our glorious city. Did you guys know we have a button you can press for entertainment? Very nice. <laughs> they all just leave. Looks like the next thing I can reasonably get is going to be the services district here for 10,000. But that may take a bit. So let's do some work around here at the village. We'll grab some of these. We'll clear out this area a little bit. Do a little bit of lawn mowing. And we'll build something we're definitely missing in this village here. Ah, oh, we have our first guest. Hold on, buddy. I'm not quite done with the build just yet. <laughs> he just leapt through the window. And here is our build. This will be our school for, uh, orphaned puppies. Yep, orphaned puppies. You know, a thing every village needs. Come on, happiness. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they like my new orphanage. Word on the street is a rich person is thinking of moving into the village. Oh, sick. If they're impressed, they'll move in and donate to the village. Oh, snap. I gotta impress them. Watch out, boys. I'm looking for a rich boy. You guys seem pretty poor, little peasants. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm the mayor, and I like to make jokes around here. Don't? Uh, it's fine. <gasps> that must be them. Hello, boys. Yes, welcome to our village. I, uh, I'm humbled to have you here. Yes, as the village mayor, here's my secretary. We like to do... Oh, no, come back. Chester, how do I impress these guys, man? I guess I can... Um, If you move in here, we can make you superstars. Check this out. Yo, oh, he, oh, he liked that. Look at this. A mighty stick. Um, Would you like an apple? <laughs> no. Uh, <gasps> Did it work? Did it work? Welcome to your new home rich person. We'll make sure your place is quite nice. I know this is your home. Uh, just, just bear with me, dude. I'll give you a better house. Yes! Take your shoes off. Stay for a while. Dude, look at that. Our currency's going up by 50 now every second. <laughs> Having rich people in your town certainly helps with the taxes. We can now buy our services district. Come on, Chester. Keep up, buddy. Let's see what we have here. Hello, sir. Looks like you need a water bottle, huh? Little thirsty? No worries. The mayor will provide. We love a mayor who gets his hands dirty, you know? Some nice fresh spring water. I hope that quenches your thirst, my boy. <gasps> firehouse unlocked. Oh, sick. Yeah, dude, check it out. We have our own firehouse. I just gave him one bottle of water. He's like, oh, good, we got it. What else can I do for you, dude? A glistening melon. Oh, that's a little harder than a water. A, a bottle of water. A bottle of water. A, bo a, a, a bottle of water. There we go. No worries, dude. Glistening melon coming right up. Oh, grab some gold. Nope. Gosh, dang it. I don't have an iron pickaxe. Ahem. We'll try that again. We'll grab our gold, grab some melons, and there's your glistening melon, my boy. Come on. A hospital! Oh, ho, ho, yes! That's so good. Now we're talking. Free health care for everyone. You see, it's not so hard. You get free health care, and you get free health care. Maybe not you. Nah, I'm just kidding. Okay, buddy, what's next? The pumpkin? No problem. I saw one earlier. There's a little pumpkin, boy. And what does this unlock? This unlocks iron golems will patrol the streets, and a new item is available in the town hall. Oh my gosh. Seems a little overkill. There's like more iron golems and villagers. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Is this the line to become citizens? Okay, yeah. Maybe the iron golems make sense now. Oh my gosh. Yes, dude. Everyone wants to move in here, man. Free health care for all and free chicken sandwiches every Tuesday. <laughs> Next up, we can buy our helpful helpers. Looks like it summons three helpful helpers that heal nearby players, put out fires, and attack hostile mobs. Oh, yeah. Nice job, boys. I like how they sparkle. What are they, Twilight vampires? Hey, check it out. We even have villagers at the karaoke bar. Is the Iron Golem going to do some stand-up? Some jokes about irony? Come on, helpful helpers, do a dance. Where'd they go? <laughs> Why did they go on the roof? They're a little shy. They're not built for the stage like I am. And... And now we can buy ourselves the public transporter. Ah, uh, there she is. It only holds like one villager at a time. <laughs> it's not the largest of public transportation, but it's better than nothing. Meep, meep. Coming through. Anyone want to be transported? Hello, gentlemen. Would you like to be transported somewhere? Oh, no, they don't want to. Okay, that's fine. I did just spend 20,000 emeralds on this. I hope it's useful. Hey, boys, you want to be transported? No. Oh, gosh. Wait, I have an idea. It might be that my villagers don't want to be transported because they're already happy in their village. So maybe I can pick up these guys. Hello, sir. <gasps> yes! Villager was sent to the main village, liked it, and became a citizen. Ah, I see. Come to Crafty Land. There's free healthcare. 
and bread. Join our civilization because one day, wait, do I get 5,000 emeralds every time I get a new citizen? Oh, all right. That just made things interesting. Do you boys really want to be stuck in this desert? Don't you want to be surrounded by safety of thousands of iron golems, apparently? <laughs> Everyone is welcome to the Craftonia. Craft, Craftopia. <laughs> That's it. Yes, look at all these villagers, man. We might need to build new houses here pretty soon. <gasps> They're already forming relationships. Might need to build a wedding venue, too. These guys are getting close. A law office. We'll have to elect a president. Man, we're building a whole civilization. The next district is the mining district. And in five, four, uh, zero. Boom! The mining district unlocked. Here it is. Let's see what we got around here. Pretty much no villagers, just iron golems. Might have to make this place a little more hospitable. There are two dandelions. I don't know. I'd move in. What do we have here? Oh, goodness. There's a man with a cobble on his head. Sir, are you okay? Cobblestone is not a hat, my man. What's up, buddy boy? I assume you need some cobblestone, huh? As if that's so impossible to get. No worries. I will put in the work for you. Eh, eh, done. There we are. We have cobblestone streets now? Yeah, dude. Check it out. This looks so nice. I like how I just handed him one piece of cobblestone. He's like, I'll take it from here. Oh, this is so nice. I'm so proud of my city. Ouch. What else do you need, buddy boy? Uh, I ironing it. I think I have one of those. Yeah. There you go, my dude. Unlocked an iron vein and my pickaxe has been upgraded. I see. Wow, that better late than never, but thank you. Whoa. Yeah, we got some infinite iron, I guess, or a large iron vein. Keep mining, my boys. They don't look very efficient, but they're getting there. Our village will be rich with iron in no time, and now you need a diamond. No worries. I got you, boo. Ah! Oh, no. Oh, uh, no. No, thank you. No, thank you. Would you like to join our city? We have a new daycare for zombies. <sighs> okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, actually, our iron pickaxe is fortune as well, which is pretty nice. Not sure how many diamonds I'll need, but that's good to know. And there's a diamond for you, my boy. I've unlocked a bank vault, and my pickaxe has been upgraded. New item available. Let's go check it out. We have a bank vault now. I guess we have a whole currency system. Oh, I love our little village. It's looking so nice. Look at look at our line of villagers. We even have little babies. They've been waiting in line for so long, they've started breeding. Be patient, my boys. We're still building houses for all you guys. The next upgrade is at 200 50,000. I don't have quite that yet, but give me a second here. Looks like I have a... Oh, here's my bank vault underneath the main town hall. Yeah, we got some diamonds, some gold. Very nice. With the bank vault back in the city, your citizens have much more income. Yeah, look at that. I'm getting a thousand emeralds a second now. Thank you for your taxes, my boys. I will put it back into the city. <laughs> look at our rich citizen just schmoozing up the new guys. Don't be weird, dude. You're gonna scare off the new citizens. We have more than enough currency. We can buy our item autumn. Mater. Oh, interesting. So, if I place a block down, I can place a villager down, and he'll mine the block basically infinitely. <laughs> so, from one log, I can get thousands of oak planks. <gasps> I can do this in the bank vault. I can multiply our money. So, if I place a villager here, and he mines the diamond block, do I get infinite? Yep. yep. Infinite diamond blocks, dude. Oh, not infinite. Okay, so he mines a stack of blocks. Well, that's all right. Can we just do this? <laughs> yeah, I can use multiple at the same time. Keep mining boys. Infinite money for the citizens of our town. Dude, at this point, who's not gonna wanna move in here, man? Here you go, boys. A nice signing bonus for joining our city. Thanks for waiting in line, my friends. And some money for you, and some money for you. That'll cover a nice house payment. That'll cover Jerry's gambling addiction. That'll cover Steven's crippling student loan debt. And for Philip, a year's supply of Oreos. And there it is. Half a million emeralds will get us our final upgrade, I'm pretty sure. The Science and Magic District. <gasps> oh, it's a whole area upstairs. Oh, snap. Hold on. Stay here, boys. Some official mayor duties. Don't don't laugh because I said duties. What's going on up here? Oh, snap. Hello, good man. Look at this. We've sent our village to the 22nd century. Look at this, man. We have a whole science lab up here. What's up, buddy? You need some obsidian? I got you. There's some lava. There's our obsidian. And there's your obsidian. I've unlocked a nether portal. Interesting. Well, I need a blaze rod, so let's go get one of those. <laughs> Just the nether portal chilling out out here. Step right up, citizens. Who makes it through the trial of the nether will get to enter into our city. <laughs> yeah. There's your blaze rod, good sir. Science and magic research has been upgraded. What the heck? I have to get an end portal frame? Aren't those unbreakable, dude? <gasps> oh, wait. I might be able to use our item automator. Let's try that. All right. Let's see if this works. Use our item automator and is it working? Yeah, it's working. I can get my end portal frames. Oh, my goodness. All right. Well, we got what we need. Uh, you 
can stay here for a while if you want. Just staring at it with an iron pickaxe. The most overpowered miner of all time. We'll give you the portal frame. Science and magic has been fully upgraded. I can now purchase the dragon protector. Oh, and we have a little dragon portal here. That's good, I guess. Every town needs a dragon portal. And now for one million emeralds, I've got the dragon protector. Yeah, we've done it, boys. Your village has become the most advanced city. We've got everything a village could possibly need, including a literal dragon to keep it safe. I would say we've done a great job turning this dirty village into the subscribe button. I mean, a beautiful, safe village for anyone to live in.